everyone, I am sitting here at one of those incredible benches. I know you've seen them downtown. It's something I noticed when I first came to Palm Springs. All the incredible artwork on these benches. I just, I only wish the artist was here so I could talk to him about this artwork. Tyson, oh my gosh, how are you? How's it going? Good to see you too. What a coincidence that you're here in Palm Springs right now. Just walking about. You know, just walking about. You have to be here for the segment. Tyson, this is super neat. Like I mentioned, I when I first moved here, which is only a few months ago, mm -hmm. I couldn't stop looking at all the different benches, and yeah. you are the artist behind all of these. Yes. Where did you get the idea for the artwork of these benches? You know, I would say it was actually a collaboration between myself and the Palm Springs Public Art Commission. Okay. They came up with an idea to save money because they were going to replace all of these benches with other benches, which was going to be a really high budget. So they came up with a clever idea to hire artists to create these beautiful art benches, yeah. right? So they uh, got in touch with me and uh, we put our ideas together and we came up with these beautiful benches you see here. Yeah. You know? So it was just a collaboration from the city of Palm Springs, public, Palm Springs Public Art Commission and myself. I love it. I love it because it really does make Palm Springs stand out and is so unique. Yeah. You said each bench takes how long to um, finish? Well, you, it, the process could take, I'll say maybe about a week. A, a week? week? Yeah, because you got to do a lot of prep work, see? When you're, when you're an artist, it's a lot of prep work that goes in before you start applying paint. Like, paint is the easiest part of doing any public art work, right? Right. So, you know, these benches were already, a, you know, a brown color. So we had to actually come in, sand them, then put primer so that when oh, we wow. put the top color, it pops out, right? Yeah. Then you got to do the design, you know, to come up. So it's, it's definitely a labor of love. Um, you know, it's, um, it's a great feeling you get once you know you created something that people can enjoy. Like, we got this young, this beautiful couple here. They're sitting on one of the benches here. Why do you guys it. think of this beautiful bench you're sitting on? <laughs> do you like yeah. it? Yeah. The artist of that bench is right here. Thank you. I appreciate it. Nice Thank and you nice. You. you just feel artistic sitting there right now, yeah. right? Yeah. yeah. Enjoying that, enjoying that looks like a really delicious Yeah, that, that smoothie looks good, too. So also check out those smoothies while yeah. you're sitting on those benches. Now, I know a big thing with artists is, you know, what people can maybe take away from mm -hmm. their artwork. Is there something you want people to take away when they enjoy the beautiful artwork on these benches? You know, I, really what I want people to take away, I just want them to be inspired. Like, I want yeah. them to inspire you. Like, if you're having a down day, I want you to look at this, this beautiful artwork. Like, wow, that's different. I mean, I just want to bring some type of... Uh, positivity to people's yeah. lives and you know, just be inspired. I mean, mm -hmm. We have a lot not to be inspired about, so it's always, right. it's always a great thing to be inspired by something. Yeah. And my main goal was that the artwork here inspires the community and also inspired the artists that was able to be a part of it. Reminding people to come together, yeah. mm -hmm. you know, when you're sitting on these benches, be inspired. Tyson, yes. thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you. All right, guys, let's go check out some more artwork.